Hello and welcome. I'm Jesse Turner, Head of Industry Education and Advocacy at APM Health. At APM Health, we specialize in providing expert assistance to property management companies. Our services range from bookkeeping and accounting to operational support and compliance, ensuring that property managers can focus on what they do best, managing properties. For more information, check out our website at www.apmhelp.com. Now let's get started with the video. Hello and welcome to this timely educational session by APM Help. Today, we'll discuss the new Arizona Senate Bill 1171, which mandates, quote, three-way reconciliation for licensed brokers and property managers. We're going to look at what through reconciliation is, why it's important, and how to perform it. First, this is the text in the bill 1171. Quote, on a monthly basis, the broker must complete a three-way reconciliation between the trust fund account bank statements, client ledgers, and trust fund account ledgers, and provide an explanation for any variation. Let's talk about what three-way reconciliation is. There are three parts to three-way reconciliation. It ensures that all the records related to trust funds are accurate and consistent. The three parts are trust fund account bank statements, which are monthly statements from the bank holding the trust funds. Client ledgers. These are detailed reports of each client's transactions and trust fund account ledgers, the internal records tracking all trust fund transactions. Why is three-way reconciliation important? First, accuracy. It ensures that all records match, reducing errors and discrepancies. Compliance. Helps brokers and property managers comply with state regulations, avoiding legal issues. Transparency provides clear and accurate financial records to clients, fostering trust. And lastly, fraud prevention. It identifies and prevents potential fraudulent activities by ensuring all transactions are accounted for. Let's talk about how to perform a three-way reconciliation. Here are the steps to perform a three-way reconciliation. One, gather bank statements, client ledgers, and trust fund account ledgers for the month. Each property management software has different settings and filters for reports, which can make this part challenging. Make sure that your software is accounting on a property basis and that your filters are set up correctly. If you want help, contact APM Help for more information. Two, compare the ending balance of the trust fund account bank statement to the total balance of the trust fund account ledger. Three, reconcile individual client ledgers with the trust fund account ledger. And four, investigate and explain any discrepancies found during the reconciliation process. As you can see, three-way reconciliation is crucial for maintaining accurate financial records, ensuring state regulatory compliance, and building trust with clients. We really recommend that you stay informed about state regulations and ensure your reconciliation processes are thorough and regular, and also in alignment with this new Arizona Senate Bill 1171. You can check the Arizona Administrative Code or Arizona Department of Real Estate for more information. And as always, for more guidance and support, visit APM Help's website or contact us directly. The website is www.apmhelp.com. Thank you and have a great day.